But man, am I excited. And I'll tell you why. Because I know uh, this weekend we've got some marquee matchups that we're really looking forward to. We're going to break down some of those uh, matchups here in just a moment. But the SEC also announced the week four kickoff times. And folks, this is when it's really kicking it in a high gear around the SEC. Saturday, September 25th. Check it. I'm going to go just in order of the kickoff times here, but uh, damn near every one of these games is exciting. Georgia at Vanderbilt, noon Eastern, 11 o'clock Central on the SEC Network. Georgia and Vanderbilt. LSU at Mississippi State, another noon Eastern, 11 o'clock Central kickoff on ESPN. And this is a matchup that may just define the season for both programs. It's rare that you have something this early in the year that you can say that about. But, hell, Mississippi State, if they take care of business this weekend against Memphis, they'll be riding high 3-0, and welcoming LSU into town after thrashing the Tigers last season. We all remember that uh, epic game. And then on the flip side, uh, you got to assume that LSU is going to win this weekend with another cupcake well, I shouldn't say Cupcake. Central Michigan, they look pretty good. They give Missouri a decent run. That's a must win for Ed, Ed Orgeron and company. And, uh, you know, people, you're not going to get any credit from Tiger fans from winning that game. You, you're supposed to win that one. Well, LSU also thinks you're supposed to win Mississippi State. So going on the road to Starkville, got to iron out the issues there for LSU. I mean, that is just a huge Huge matchup. And, hell, we haven't even moved off the noon time slot yet because we got Missouri at Boston College. Really underrated matchup here. Boston College's coach also, uh, I believe, in his second year, he's been doing some good stuff there with the Eagles. That's a noon Eastern, 11 o'clock Central on ESPN2, Missouri at Boston College. That looks to be an interesting matchup. And then huge one here, Texas A&M versus Arkansas in Arlington has been selected as the CBS 330 Eastern, 230 Central kickoff, the second one of the season. Of course, uh, this weekend, Alabama at Florida. That'll be the first SEC on CBS selection. But, man, the Hogs are feeling good. And after Texas A&M struggled last weekend after uh, Hayes King went down, we'll get to that uh, here in a moment, but... This is looking like uh, potentially the best Arkansas team that Texas A&M has seen since they went into the SEC. So can the streak finally end? It's in Jerry World once again. Jerry was at the game over the weekend beating Texas. So who knows? Maybe they got some of that Jerry Jones magic in them. I cannot wait for that matchup. Texas A&M, Arkansas could be college game day too. If you just look around the schedule nationally, Texas A&M at Arkansas, Would be a great selection there, assuming both those teams take care of business this weekend as expected. Georgia State at Auburn, 4 o'clock Eastern on SEC Network, 3 o'clock Central. This will be uh, obviously after the Penn State game that uh, we'll touch on all week long here, but that'll be an interesting one. And then here we go to the night games. We got three interesting night games here. Tennessee at Florida, 7 o'clock Eastern, 6 o'clock Central, on ESPN, Cousin Shane <laughs> was not happy to see this one. The Vols under the light. And I've seen a lot of Tennessee fans after uh, the pit game, especially very disappointed. They were hoping for a nooner to sneak in there in Gainesville. But I don't know. I got a good feeling about this one for the Vols. Not saying they're they're obviously going to be a heavy underdog in this one. But Florida coming off the Alabama game. Tennessee in these night games. I think they... Typically fare pretty well. They got Tennessee Tech this weekend. Should be a big bounce back performance. Uh, I'm not ready to write the balls off here, but uh, that's going to be a great one. ESPN, Saturday night, SEC football. Always uh, the makings of a good game there. Kentucky at South Carolina. Oh, this is one uh, each fan base. You know, expects to win on an annual basis here. 7 o'clock Eastern, 6 o'clock Central on ESPN2. So the SEC is taking over ESPN uh, week 4, September 25th. Great matchup here under the lights. Kentucky. I mean, we've seen uh, what that uh, House of Horrors Williams-Brice Stadium can be for opposing teams. Again, I know Kentucky is going to be favored in this matchup, and they should be. They've been outstanding so far this season. 
But uh, South Carolina keeps finding a way to win. I know they got to face Georgia this weekend. Tough matchup, but uh, some magic under the lights there. That could be a great one. And then finally, Southern Miss at Alabama, 7.30 Eastern, 6.30 Central on SEC Network. So that's a look ahead to week four, September 26th, but some great games. Getting fired up, just sitting here thinking about it.